I just wanted to show off, you know what I mean? <laughs> In under two years, the government of St. Lucia, led by Prime Minister Honorable Philip J. Pierre, is on course to furnish every secondary school student with a laptop device, an accomplishment never before attained until the commencement of Prime Minister Pierre and his cabinet's tenure in office. Thank you very much, and I'm sure the students will look forward to the use of, the, of these Chromebooks. And I want to thank the Minister of External Affairs for being able to, as you would see, navigate <laughs> through, the, the, through the waters of the diplomatic channels. And Minister of External Affairs, you'll be requested to do some more. Thousands of laptop and Chromebook devices have already been distributed in the last 18 months. On April 11th, the government officially accepted another 5,000 new devices from Taiwan. The new tech is earmarked for distribution among the incoming first form secondary school students ahead of the commencement of the 2023-2024 academic year in September. Minister for Education, Honorable Sean Edward, has embraced Prime Minister Pierre's progressive one laptop per child policy and continues to inspire the ensuing integration of modern technology into St. Lucian classrooms. When we took to the Hurstings leading up to the elections of 2021, we made a promise to the people of St. Lucia, and more specifically the children of St. Lucia, those who were old enough to understand that we would reinstate the one laptop per child program. And today, here we are, another demonstration of that commitment, another manifesto pledge fulfilled. As an administration, we decided that the government would meet the cost of procuring devices for students across the length and breadth of this country, irrespective of their socioeconomic background, irrespective of their parents' political affiliation, irrespective of their station in life. Today, as we speak, every child in the school system has a state-issued device. The Republic of China on Taiwan continues to play an instrumental role in the government's reimagined classroom modernization and laptop initiative. My government really support the one child, uh, one student, one uh, computer program that promotes by Honorable Prime Minister Free JPA and the government of St. Lucia. So we are honored to be part of this program, to be able to donate 5,000 Chromebooks today. The government's one laptop per child policy was the brainchild of former Prime Minister, Dr. Honorable Kenny Anthony, and initially introduced to St. Lucia's secondary school system between the years 2011 to 2016. The wisdom of Dr. Anthony's one laptop per child policy was underscored during the height of the COVID-19 pandemic when the Ministry of Education had to employ a distance learning concept to keep students engaged with their teachers during a time when public health measures restricted in-person learning to minimize COVID-19 infections. From the office of the Prime Minister, Rihani Isidore.